Welcome to Saigon, Ho Chi Minh. And this is a little great find. It's called 4P Pizza. I've been here before a couple years ago. And wow, how it's uh, Yosoke. How did you decide to open a pizza restaurant in Ho Chi Minh? Uh, how did I? Uh, I, I used to work for the like, uh, uh, private equity company, uh, I used to be a venture capital, but I quit that job and I made a pizza restaurant. You followed your dream yes, to I open followed. a restaurant. Yes. It's yes. been five years now? Five years now. Twelve years ago, I made a pizza oven in my garden as a hobby. <laughs> that, that's the <a> start. <laughs> and it grew and grew. And Sanai, yes. um, th this is um, his wife, and you look after the restaurant. Yeah. And besides the restaurant, do you have online shopping? Yes, we do. The, because we product our homemade, like a mozzarella cheese. Yeah, we product our cheese. Then our customer asks us, to, why can we buy? By the internet. So you, you have a farm in Delat, which is in northern Vietnam, and you have Holstein cows, and you produce all the cheeses for your restaurant and for your online. Yes. Yeah. Uh, mainly the restaurant main, we yes. use, and we sell to other restaurants and hotels as well. And so what type of cheeses are you producing now? Now we do mozzarella, ricotta, uh, mascarpone, and camembert, and brata. brata. Oh, brata. Yeah. Because and that's very popular now, I yeah. And uh, trying to proceed uh, blue cheese. Oh, really? That's different. So, why did you pick Holstein? Is it because of the fat content? Uh, uh, we, we can't find out the other cars in. Oh, really? So, Holstein? So, yeah. so, how many do you have now? Uh, only 15. Only 15 we have. Like, like, this is kind of like test. Uh, what we do, we try to uh, do for other uh, farmers, which we buy now. So do you have cheese produced every day? Yeah. And then it's shipped here? Do you have daily shipments? Yeah, from? Daily shipments. Wow. Yeah. We produce about, uh, uh, we using one ton of milk every day. Yes. But we pro our cow farm produce only uh, 200, 200. 200, 200 liter. I, I came here two years ago because my brother works for the Canadian consulate and I'm going where are we going it's in an alley <laughs> how did you find this location uh, it was lucky uh, there is a one cafe before yes. Vietnamese cafe but a little like, interesting it's a ham but people uh, come many young people get out there, then we thought that, oh, these are quite interesting. It's kind of trendy because there's lots of Japanese restaurants around here. And do, do are most of your customers Korean Japanese or do you find more Westerners coming now? Uh, 60, 60% Vietnamese. Okay. 60-70% Vietnamese. Yeah. Then 15% your uh, Western, European and American. And you, and you, how many um, pizza ovens now? You have two? Three we have. Oh, and, and I love the style of your pizza. You have classical pizza like margarita and prosciutto, but you have some Japanese ones, like I saw the ekonomiyaki pizza. <laughs> <laughs> and you have the sashimi pizza, you know. So what's the most popular pizza here? Uh, at this moment, it's burrata pizza. Burrata. Then four cheese. Or cheese. Then teriyaki and sashimi, yeah, the Japanese ones. Japanese yeah. ones. So this is great. I think, I'm um, congratulations, your young couple, and I, it's a very popular restaurant. You know, to me, I had to come back because I had such good pizza last time. So I come back every couple years. So thank you so much. Thank you. So much. Thank you. Very much. Thank you.